Hey guys, welcome back. So in today's video, I am doing a braid out using Blue Magic Grease. So let's hop right into this video. So here I'm starting on freshly washed hair and I have four sections already in my head and I'm going to start in the lower back. I've already detangled my hair in the shower. Now I did this just to make the process easier and with this section I'm going to go ahead and split the hair into two sections. And once I do that, I'm going to clip the other piece at the top. And then I'm going to go ahead and spritz my hair with lots of water. And in the next process, I will lather it up with the Blue Magic Grease, starting from the roots all the way down to the tips. And I'm also featuring this Felicia Leatherwood Detangle Brush. I use this while detangling my hair in the shower and it is awesome. You guys should try it out. Now once I'm done lathering the hair with grease, I just split the hair into three pieces and I begin braiding or plaiting the hair downward. Now, you don't want to plait the hair all the way down to the ends because you're gonna have straight ends you want to still have the ends of your hair curled or spiraled. And so you want to have at least one inch of your hair left to where you can kind of twirl the ends, how I have it here. Also, let's be sure to brush out any knots in the hair. We want our hair to be as smooth as possible as we're braiding the hair downward. We don't want any frizz. So this was literally the next day and I have about eight plaits in my hair and my hair was about 90% dry. So let's keep our fingers crossed that this hairstyle comes out pretty nice. Now once I'm done unraveling the hair, I'm going to continue to pull other pieces of my hair apart just to give my hair that fullness that I like. And of course, the more you pick your hair apart, the more frizz you're going to get. And I like my hair full. And I'm going to use this wide tooth comb as well to lift my roots to also give it more value. And so you can kind of do this to your liking. Now I can't forget to lay those edges down. This is my favorite edge controller. Um, this edge control will put the babies to sleep. 
like they will lay them down and I love this stuff so much you don't even have to use a scarf or anything to set your edges it just automatically lays it down but I will be sure to link this product in the description box Now the only thing I was not fond of was greasy hands, but other than that, it turned out great. Okay guys, so I had to catch this lighting real quick. And y'all see these waves? Y'all see the definition? Y'all see that moisture? Now I do have a little frizz in there, and that's all right. A little frizz ain't never hurt nobody. And I actually kind of like a little frizz here and there. But um, I would definitely use magic grease again um, for one is because my hair is moisturized that's something you always want to make sure your hair has is moisture and um, it has it has some body and everything y'all like y'all got to get into this 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 braid out I got because I would definitely do this again and then you have to remember too is that my hair is gonna get bigger and bigger and so I'm all about volume and some definition. So y'all please be sure to leave some comments in the comment section and let me know if you're gonna check out this Blue Magic Grease or not, okay? So thank you guys so much for watching the video. I'll catch you guys in the next one.